Hi, this is Ian Mitchell with VTech Communications, and I'm just going to show off a quick video on how to set up Wi-Fi on our phones. Um, we support a couple of different Wi-Fi uh, dongles, or uh, USB dongles, in order to provide Wi-Fi for the phone. Um, one of them happens to be, it used to be the VTech uh, VU020, which is now the SNOME A210. Um, and we also support uh, like a TP-Link and Edimax. You can find the full list of um, what particular Wi-Fi drivers or chipsets we support on the SNOME Wiki. Um, for this particular purpose, I'm going to be using um, this uh, TP-Link, the TLWN823N. And we'll notice that when the phone boots up, it'll basically just kind of get stuck at sending DHCP request because, of course, um, at this point, I'm only using an AC adapter and there's nothing plugged in. But if we just hit the X, we'll be able to cancel past that and the phone will finish booting up. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and plug in our Wi-Fi USB here into the side. And just let the phone finish booting up. Okay, and we can cancel out of the um, Ethernet uncabled or the Ethernet cable unplugged message. We don't need to worry about that. And we're going to go into settings, and we're going to go into network, and then uh, WLAN. So you said four, you can scroll down. So first things, we'll turn wireless LAN on. And again, I do have the USB Wi-Fi adapter plugged in now. Now that it's on, we can go ahead and scan for networks out there. should just take about 15 to 20 seconds to um, scan the networks out there and then it should provide you a list along with the um, signal so we can see we got a couple of different ones so for this particular test we're gonna go ahead and connect to this uh, queue done right here just hit the check mark in order to enter it it'll of course ask for your password so we'll just enter the password for this particular network in and hit the check mark now it shows that we're actually connected, um, but we actually do require a reboot in order for this to actually fully take place. So we'll go ahead and hit this uh, reboot button. And it should just take a minute here for the uh, phone to go into reboot. You can see we're setting DHCP requests again, and it should pop up with an IP address here in just a minute. And we've got an IP address. Just finishing up the boot process here, and then we should see that the phone will actually boot up to a registered state. Okay, so we see while well, was active, going through redirection, if there is any redirection available. And we can see that we have now registered our extension. We do get this message that the Ethernet cable is unplugged just because, you know, by default, um, we would suggest using Ethernet if available. Um, but we can actually just go into the info here and delete that particular message because we don't care that the Ethernet is unplugged. And now your phone's working. We can make a call and everything. And everything's working. Test audio menu. And that's how you set up Wi-Fi.